Um, all right, so I'm going to try and give you a little bit um, of a sense of what a Zoom might look like. So, um, so you're on your computer. So I've got a Zoom that I'm going to start um, on my phone. So don't worry about that, where it comes from. But I've, I've got the Zoom that I'm going to start on my phone. So I'm going to give you a sense of what it looks like from your end. Okay, from your end. And then I'll kind of go, and then I'm going to share my screen. Um, and then I'll go through this document that I went over with the kids today and that I live streamed and had about 30 people watching. So uh, hopefully it was helpful. So you, the students are going to go to their inbox or they're going to go to a, sh a Google Sheet. Um, and the Google Sheet, um, let me, so... Again, I'll, I'll put this link in the doc, by the way. Sixth grade, yours is going to look a little bit different. And I'll pull that up, too. So this is more what the um, eighth grade or seventh and eighth grade is, is going to look like. However, some of the teachers are going to be sending their, um, their Zoom links through Google Classroom, OK? So there's going to be different ways to, to open it up and to check them out and to go find your Google link. So it's going to be here. Definitely check Google Classroom. As I said in my um, conversation with the kids today, um, they need to go through their school inbox and double check, double check that they've accepted invites to any new Google Classrooms that they've been invited to. So that's got to be number one. Got to be number one. Okay, so you get a Google link or a Zoom link. Um, so I sent one to my Yahoo account, and and I'm going to click on the link. Uh, this says UC Denver because I'm a graduate student at Denver, UC Denver, and this is what it, what it looks like. But nonetheless, you're going to click on your Zoom link. Okay, so now it's going to pop up. Chrome has extensions, so uh, so I'm going to my name. So I'm going to put. I would put my full name, okay? And the students, make sure you put your real name. Don't mess around, because we got to know who it is. So put your first and last name. Spell it correctly, please. So I'm going to join. So join without video, join with video. I'm going to suggest that you join with video, okay? And then I'm going to join with computer audio so that you don't have to have a microphone like this. I just, I'm on Zoom calls all the time for grad school and actually for school that uh, I, I just happen to have one of these headsets. You don't have to. Okay. So I'm going to join audio and now you are using computer audio. So now I'm going to start. I'm going to. All right. All right. So I muted, because I'm on the phone here, so I muted that. So nonetheless, obviously I can see myself twice. Um, this is my phone, right? So the teacher is going to be in one, and the student is going to be in the other, OK? So don't worry about that. You're, you're not going to see yourself twice. Um, but I just wanted to give you kind of a sense of what that looks like. Now you can leave the meeting. So when class is over, make sure you leave the meeting so that you're able to um, join your next Zoom meeting. Okay, that's really important. Um, all right. So anyway, that's what it's going to look like. Then you're going to end. Yes, please leave the meeting. So I will, I'm going to shut it down here on my phone, leave the meeting, and now it's over. Okay, so that's what it's going to look like. All right, so now I'm going to pull up this doc and just kind of go through this document. Alrighty. And then I'm going to send this out to you all as well. All right, um, e-learning days. Um, Dr. K and I, Dr. K 
created the vast majority of this document. I'm going to add some other stuff to it. Um, but nonetheless, highly recommend that you kind of keep some sort of normal um, mode here um, just to kind of stay in the rhythm. Monday, it's probably going to be let's just kind of figure this out. We're going to do some learning Monday, but we're asking that each student kind of figure out um, their tech this weekend, okay? So that come Monday, we can kind of hit the ground running. Uh, so anyway, this is the schedule here, okay? That's the schedule there. Again, as I said in my Zoom chat and said to the student, or uh, my live stream, and then also said to the students, CDE requires that we take attendance. So the teachers are going to take attendance in RenWeb. So when if you're in first hour, you got to get in there at 8.30. Okay, you got to get in there at 8.30 so that we can mark you present. Okay. Um, find a spot in your, in your house that you can spend a lot of time at. Okay. Um, comfortable chair, good lighting, a place to put your computer and books and um, uh, comp books and expand files and glass of water and all that good stuff. Okay, so find a good spot that's comfortable and you're going to be able to spend a lot of time at. Okay, a uh, few distractions, um, things like that. And then uh, because a lot of this is going to be online, uh, obviously, uh, we get some fresh air. Now, I'm not, like I said to the students, don't go to the mall and hang out at the mall, um, not wise. Uh, maybe go for a walk around your neighborhood, kick a ball, uh, catch a ball, get hit by a ball, um, hang out, uh, sit on the back porch. Um, the, weather's supposed to, the weather's supposed to be nice. But we ultimately have to treat this, you know, like a quarantine, right? So we're going to stay inside as much as possible. Uh, we got to be safe. Um, and and uh, avoid big crowds. In fact, our church, uh, we're not going to have church for the next couple of weeks, which is really disappointing. So trying to figure out what to do with that. Uh, so anyway, wash your hands a bunch and all that good stuff. So hopefully um, this provides a little bit of direction, a little bit of guidance. I'm going to send out another, uh, I'm going to send this out um, to you as well. Um, so you'll, you'll be able to see it. Um, and then uh, I'll be online, and I'll probably uh, be zooming out. I'll send you a, a thing through the Remind uh, just to kind of give a heads up or an update, um, things like that. So anyway, hopefully this was helpful, and you were able to, to gain something from it. But uh, anyway, thanks for your patience as we walk this journey. As I told the kids, I've been at this nearly 30 years, and this is in a historical week. Uh, can't remember something so odd and mysterious and anxiety producing, to be honest. So uh, anyway, we uh, will be in touch. Pray, pray, pray.